Hello and welcome to yet another YouTube video here on this channel. Today we are diving into two of my favorite visual note-taking apps and probably two of the best note-taking apps for people who like to work or not necessarily like to but are working in design, filmmaking and just really creative fields uh, or are just very very visual people uh, we are going to take a look at both Milanote and x tiles because i think both of them are great options and they are pretty different in the way they work so uh, just a disclaimer i personally use Milanote as my own project manager that's why uh, it has a lot more information than my x tiles but i've tried to build out my x tiles here as well uh, so let's take a look at uh, Milanote to start with so Milanote has a great uh, ipad app which uh, i use a lot that's why i decided to use this as my project manager because I use it with an Apple Pencil and uh, and my iPad. But the way this works is that you have boards like I have here. All of these are boards and within boards you can have other boards like I have here. You can have columns, you can create yourself Kanban boards and that's what I've done here. So I have a lot of my to-dos here. These are things I actually have to do every single day or week or things that I'm doing here I have a sponsored video on ongoing project so I've just put it here so it is easy to see uh, you can add due dates to your to-do lists here let me just zoom in and show you how that works uh, so you can add due dates uh, like I have right here uh, and you can also uh, create as I said uh, Kanban boards which I've done for all of my social media and I have my color palette here as well in case I need to design something. So I have multiple boards and the way I have set it up is that I also have copies of my board so this lives in multiple places both of or actually all three of these uh, live in multiple uh, spaces. This is just a way for me to quickly see how many projects I am working on and projects that I might want to work on later. Um, that's how I have set this up. So I have my idea seats and my projects here and I also have resources here as well. Where I have my outfit ideas here I put different outfits. I have some pictures for inspiration, some quotes. This actually these two also live in multiple places and um, that is something that's really important to know about um, Milnote is that both boards but also different cards which are these right here note cards or uh, to-do cards link cards they can live in multiple places and you can see where they live so if we take a look at my note-taking apps I have uh, a list of every note-taking app I haven't finished this yet but I'm building out a list of every note-taking app inside of here and I have a template because this app allows you to have templates as well so I have a board template I use for this uh, so I have a list of all of the note taking apps. I have some book notes inside of here. I don't put all of my book notes inside of here. I only put book notes whenever I'm actually going to work on a, a specific video or a project uh, that requires having my books uh, in here. So, for example, in Day Trading Attention and Create Dangerously, I only have two cards in each one of them. And that is simply because I, um, simply because I only uh, needed two quotes to actually use. I have my templates here and I have some uh, articles right here, personal thoughts uh, and some, just some other uh, resources right here as well. And this is organized in para, so I have my day job, my clothing brand, uh, archive, as well as people. I actually don't use this a lot. 
so this is basically how um, mill note works. You have these different things you can actually add in to your infinite canvas uh, and you can even sketch inside of here. Uh, so that is basically how this application works. They have a great web clipper and you can easily clip things and even send things through from your notes. They have a quick notes feature, which I use a lot. And then you can drag them in from your notes. This is also a great application if you are working in a team. The notes pricing plan uh, is, uh, like this they have a free plan which gives you a hundred notes images or links 10 file uploads and unlimited shared boards but you can also uh, pay for the pro plan which gives you unlimited of everything that's ten dollars uh, or 9.99 each month on the yearly or 12.50 on the monthly now let's take a look at X Tiles. So X Tiles is similar in a way because it is highly visual. One thing I really like about this that Milanote does not have is the fact that you can have all of your tasks um, gathered in one place. So in Milanote you don't actually have a central place for all of your tasks tasks across all project which is something i'm not a big fan of um so that is something that uh extiles has over Milanote. you also have an inbox feature right here where you can send things either through the chrome extension or with your uh, mobile app uh, so very similar to uh the inbox feature in Milanote. However, I think this is a little bit better since you can actually also use it in the app. So let's say I'm working on something and I just want to quickly jot down uh, a note. I can easily do that right here. That isn't possible in Milanote. Uh, so that is also something it has over Milanote. Uh, when it comes to the organization of this, we have uh, these let's call them boards. Uh, that's probably the best uh, thing I can call them. Uh, boards, I'm not sure if they are actually called boards, uh, but you can have a board and you can actually have databases inside of here. So notion like databases, you can actually have that here. Tables with different types of views. Again, something that Milanote does not have. They have a table a basic table but they do not have databases inside of here you can actually have databases as well with different views let's see if i have one for my social media so right here you can have uh, a lot of um, different properties and you can even link notes to this so i would say that this is probably more similar to notion but this is probably closer to something we can see inside of Milanote. So you can create these tiles, uh, and that's what they're called. And inside of here, you can actually have basic tables. You can have tasks, you can have images, or you can just add a simple uh, note. You can also backlink things like I've done here. So I've linked to different things inside of here. Uh, so that is also something you can do inside of uh, X tiles that you can't do inside of Milanote. Um, and you uh, can also uh, add images here as well and embed things. So I have a couple of embeds right here. I have a Spotify one and I have uh, a weather one right here as well. So when it comes to pricing, um, Xtiles is actually cheaper. You get unlimited blocks, pages, projects, collections, and views, unlimited storage, five megabytes file size, uh, three personal workspaces, and invite 10 guests. Um, that is the free plan, which is a great free plan. So this, and they say it here as well, this is great for personal productivity uh, while uh, the plus right here uh, is a lot uh, better for teams and this is I would say that uh, 
looking at Milanote versus Extiles is sort of wrong because they do different things. Uh, however, I feel personally like uh, Extiles is a lot more similar to something like Notion. So how I would describe the difference here is that Milanote actually works better with files so images and different files while Xtiles works better for uh, databases if that is something you need and visual like text notes and both of them are more project manager oriented and more of like all-in-one applications than they are just note-taking apps but i wanted to do a comparison because someone asked me uh, on uh, instagram so i thought i would make the video uh, if you have any questions feel free to leave them down below and i will try to get to them as soon as i can thank you so so much for watching and i will probably do a comparison video between x tiles and notion later in a couple of weeks thank you so so much for watching